Be a legacy builder. You bring work home. Yeah, but you don't I do. Work from home. No. But do you guys ever have business talks on the table? Of course, a business talks is always on the table. Yeah. Because, you know, it's it's very important for the family to know what we talk about. You cannot. <laughs> it's we we're not in Hollywood yeah. where you get in and then you zip. Yeah. your mouth yeah. and then when you get out you talk business no yeah. Yeah. business is family yeah. right so so we have that conversation every yeah. time the little opportunity we have we talk like i always say my wife mandisa is a cheerleader yeah. you know uh she knows the ins and out of the business better than sometimes even me yeah. and better than anybody that has ever worked with me or anybody that's working with me at this current time yeah. because life is short yeah. life is very short yeah. and 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 you do not want people to steal your legacy. Yeah. Because why? Your wife is a lady, so she must sit at the corner. Mm -hmm. I, I don't I don't believe in that. I was never brought up that way. You need to be able yeah, to take over. over. Yes. Yeah, uh, yeah. I mean I brought, I was brought up in a family where my dad is very, you know, open-minded. Yeah. My mom drives businesses, yeah. right? And that's very important. And I am who I am because of what I've learned from home. So business talk is very, very important. You must always have that business conversation. And that's, that gives you the leeway to stay out at night a little bit more when it's the time is needed. Because the family understands the responsibilities and how hard it is to run the business. Yeah. Conversation is very clear. You know, this is where we are. We budget together because business money is completely different from family money. Right? So if you don't have business talks, you're going to run your family down. So, so with that being said, now, Echo, there's, there's, you know, there's, there's this challenge of managing time. Yeah. And I think it beats a lot of people, those that do a 9 to 5 and those that are in business. Yes. Not knowing how to best manage your time. Yes. You know, making time for family, making time for fun, yes. you know, relaxation like we are now, yeah. as we usually do, distress. Yeah. yeah. So let's talk about time management and how important it is. Time management is very crucial, especially, you know, I find myself in a very uh, unique predicament in the sense that I'm, I'm running a growing business yeah. at the same time running a growing family. Yeah. <laughs> so quality of time with the family is very crucial to me. Mm -hmm. I wouldn't forgo that with, for anything, yeah. right? So I'd rather sacrifice my time, my sleep time mm -hmm. to do my work. And that doesn't make me feel guilty because they're sleeping anyway. You cannot miss out when people are sleeping. Yeah, true. <laughs> you can only miss out when people are moving All around. The rest, we are burning the yeah, ex well. Exactly, yeah. exactly. So, so that's how I keep that balance going, yeah. right? You work whilst everyone is sleeping. I will never sacrifice quality time with my family, but I will sacrifice a bit of my sleep time so that I can get the business to also run because you need to be productive, to feed the family. The other thing I I always feel is very important yeah. when you get into business, especially in the real estate, nice yes. property investment. Yes. You've taught me that buying property that's very close to where you reside. Yes. It's very important because it cuts then the travel time and, and so forth. You yes. Know, you get time back because time is one important currency that once it's wasted, you cannot get back. Yes. Right? Yes. So what I've done is, even with my location where I live, yes. I always make sure that I'm closer to my office. Um, then I cut down on travel time yes. and so forth and so on. Until I can afford a driver, yes. can drive me around and I can work while I'm in And that's coming. And that's coming. You're going to get a driver soon. Yeah. So, so yeah. which takes me to the third point now in, 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 in one of your strategies yes. of how you balance um, uh, business and, and family and also your day to day life. Yeah, the travel so, time. Let's talk about the travel time. So, to me, the travel time is very important, and, I, and that's why I always say to you, you know, that check the travel time because it's such a waste. Travel time is such a waste. So, to me, like you know, the office, the office is like 10 minutes away from the house. The school where the kids go is like 10 minutes away from the office. So I get to spend a lot of time with the kids. And, and why do I do that? Because it helps me to keep my responsibility at home intact. I want to be a family man. I do not want to be a working man, right? 
but I work a lot. I work it's at my every day. If you don't work too, you can't feed your family. Yeah. <laughs> right? Yeah. So so to me, the little chat we have in the car, getting home early, you know, every now and then go home, have lunch with my wife, you know, those are the things that's very important to me. So location is key in terms of where my business is placed and where my family's livelihood is yeah. placed. Yeah. Be a legacy builder, watch the next video and don't forget to subscribe.